Good day, everyone. Uh, this is Ned from Pion Tech. And today I'm very excited to have a chat about our new 48 volt battery, uh, US 5000. So um, a little bit about Pylon Tech first. Pylon Tech is a public listed manufacturer of LFT battery. We founded in 2009 and our initial business is actually the cathode material, uh, which mostly is LFP. Our first storage system uh, is used in telecom backup. And then we develop our solar and the battery storage system uh, for residential and the CNI application. Uh, we deliver our first residential battery to Australian and the European market since 2013. And in 2020, Pylon Tech is the first ESS focused company that listed in China stock market. Now our company development are well secured uh, from the aspect of cash flow and business operation. Currently, we have uh, three battery factories in China. One is the sales factory in Jiangsu province with 5.5 gigawatt annual production capacity and the two pack assemble factory for the system integration. And also our hand office and R&D center is based in Shanghai. The unique of Pylon Tech is that we have uh, vertically integrated the whole lithium battery industrial chain from raw materials to cells and the battery system. And also combined with our in-house BMS technology. So for, for which we can strictly control over every link of the supply chain stability and also the production quality to ensure our products extraordinary performance. Here are some highlights uh, already over 3.5 gigawatt hour battery uh, have been delivered and uh, installed. Continuous high investment on the ESS driven R&D and the production from raw materials to battery system. Uh, Pion Tech has also been ranked by the uh, IHS research as top two residential lithium battery manufacturer uh, in 2020. Now we have developed the whole product range from the 12 volt to up to 1,500 volt for various applications such as the portable power bank to 12 volt caravan and the marine market and also the residential CNI solar battery market. Um, now I today mainly focus on the new 48 volt residential battery product, US 5000, uh, which has uh, 48 volt and 100 amp hour capacity. This is the safest and the power, powerful battery ever. So um, let's dive into it. Firstly, I want to talk about the inverter compatibility. Based on our self-developed BMS technology, all of our new product will inherit the strong inverter compatibility, and it will also able to work with all the previous US battery modules too. So uh, you can imagine that you will have no limitations on the capacity expansion for an old system you can easily to mix use all Pylon Tech 48 volt series battery in one single system and uh, have the best flexibility to configure the battery bank and to work with the tier one inverter brands in Australia. It's applied for any like on-grid, off-grid or hybrid system. Now I, I want to talk more a little bit about the uh, high reliability of Pylon Tech US battery family. Uh, below is a snapshot from the latest ITP battery testing report. Uh, I'm sure most of our audience have heard about this test. Uh, this is the world's first lithium battery comparison test in, in Canberra. Uh, funded by the government organization, Australian Renewable Energy Agency. The, the aim of this testing is to, uh, is to independently verify the battery performance uh, to against manufacturer's clients 
like uh, the overall stability, the battery capacity degradation, and also uh, round trip efficiency. They will uh, do the battery cycles, like three cycles per day in a temperature control room. And the Pylon Tech US battery was added in uh, 2017, starting from the second phase of the testing. Uh, as you can see from this snapshot, while some battery products had experienced the faults or failure, Pylon Tech US series battery had demonstrated the highest reliability with no issues happen throughout, throughout the testing periods by now. Um, besides the overall stability, uh, the capacity degradation performance is also one of the most important feature. It's determining how many battery power will still left uh, after many years cycles, just like the battery in our mobile phone. From the, uh, the latest capacity testing result, uh, you can find that bat Pylon Tech batteries still continue to demonstrate excellent capacity retention over a large number of cycles. You can to check the, uh, the real-time data from ITP uh, battery website. Um, now uh, I want to talk about the safety and the quality of the US 5000. So first, the US 5000 still use LFP as cathode material which is well known as the safer materials for lithium battery. Many uh, auto manufacturers are also starting to use the LFP in their new electric vehicle uh, because of the high thermal tolerance performance. As I mentioned before, uh, Pylon Tech has, is starting from the lithium battery raw materials business. And by now, we already accumulate more than 10 years experience on the LFP raw materials R&D and application, and uh, just for energy storage application only. Uh, and by this year, Q3, Pylon Tech has delivered our product to more than 360,000 families worldwide. Our product has uh, been proven by the time and the larger quantity customer base. And uh, more importantly, uh, is the improvement on the power performance. US 5000 can support continued 80 amps charging and discharging current, uh, which is equally to 0.8C rating and the maximum power up to 120 amp for 15 minutes and the peak surge power up to 200 amp for 15 seconds can easily just install the one US 5000 battery for your system and you can achieve two times US 2000 battery capacity and the three times current power. Um, Beside that, we also have imp implemented uh, four levels of the current protection to ensure the US 5000 safety and uh, which is more easier to comply with the AS5139 installation requirement as a pre-assembled uh, best battery system. Uh, each US 5000 has a built-in BMS inside each battery module. And on the BMS PCB board, it has equipped a charging discharge modes and the dual fuse protection, both uh, passive and active fuse to protect the short circuit current. And also in the PMU, it has designed a pre-charge circuit uh, design to smooth the surge starting car current. And the lastly, the last protection is the bipole inbuilt DC breaker uh, on each battery module uh, for the overcurrent protection. And uh, at the same time, in the BMS software design, we also achieve a smoother output power ability. Uh, it can ensure the US 5000 to output more energy when temperature uh, below, 10, min, uh, below 10 degrees C or above 45 degrees. Uh, now talk about the installation. Uh, US series are all 90 inch rack mounted design. You can flexible to use 90 inch rack or cabinet to install a battery. 
And the US 5000 also come with small compact design. The dimension and the weight of US 5000 is uh, thinner and lighter than, than the two units of US 2000 module. And the one master US 5000 can take 15 units of workers US 5000 in one single com strings. You can also use a LV hub, which is a communication management device uh, to set up the multiple string system uh, up to 480 units in one single system. And the US 5000 has uh, also has a wide working temperature range from minor 10 degrees to 50 degrees C. And the installation altitude is also up to 4,000 meters. It can be easily installed in all Australian regions. Um, so to move on, uh, this is an overall parameter of the new US 5000. Like all Pylon Tech US series battery, it has certified the high, highest safety standard of lithium battery storage product, uh, like a UL certification, IEC, IEC certification, and it will also soon be CC certified in Australia by the end of this year. Um, so to sum up my, my presentation today, uh, as a dedicated lithium battery manufacturer, Pylon Tech will continue to bring the best battery product for your energy storage system uh, in terms of reliable product supply and also ensure the product quality and the performance. Um, so uh, let's speak. Thank you very much for your time. So if you have any questions, uh, please feel free to contact with me. Thank you, Ned. Uh, thanks, Ned. Yeah. Um, I, I'm just looking through the Q and A questions, and there's a question here: uh, When will we see uh -huh. the U you, When will we see the US 5000 in Australia? Uh, probably Q4 this year. And um, I think uh, around December or Jan next year, sometime like that. Okay. And, and I just had a question. It was, the, and I'm not sure if you did cover it in your presentation, but is it, uh, is it a, are you able to use um, that US 5000 in a, a parallel with your existing systems? So, you know, the other, other models? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, you know, the BMS technology in all our 48 volt US series is the same. So the customer can easily to choose either like US 2000, US 3000 or US 5000 to mix use all this module in one single system. The BMS will automatically to managing the communication internally. Excellent, excellent. Um, do we have any other, uh, so, uh, there's a question here, Ned, do you have any curves showing reduction in cycle life at higher temperatures? So maybe you could just talk about high temperatures and what effect they might have. Uh, yes, um, you know, the temperature is the biggest killer for lithium battery. So usually we will testing the battery degradation the capacity degradation under uh, 25 degrees C, which is the best temperature for the lithium battery. Uh, either lower or higher temperature will uh, have a, a more severe degradation on the remaining capacity. Uh, we can, I, I can share the Pylon Tech uh, battery uh, capacity degradation curve for the audience. If you interested in it, please email, email me and I will share more uh, performance report with you. Excellent. So it, it, again, it kind of um, from installers and designers looking at where they might be choosing locations, you know, trying to get, mm -hmm. that, get that median sort of temperature is, is an important consideration. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I can give you a roughly idea. For example, if you use the battery in a 25 degrees C temperature, you might have a, a remaining capacity after 10 years around um, 80 percent. But in our normal usage, right, the temperature has a wider range, uh, but you can still also have at least 60 percent uh, capacity after 
uh, 10 years. So this is the difference range between the best uh, temperature and the normal temperature. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, no, that makes sense. Excellent. Mm -hmm. um, anybody got another question to throw into uh, the Q&A for Ned? Just looking now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there's a there's a, a question here. Curious why Pylon Tech is listed as an information technology and services company on LinkedIn. <laughs> well, <laughs> like you're an IT company that does uh, storage as well. Energy yeah, storage. yeah, yeah. Sure. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> um, okay. Well, we we might leave it there. Thank you very much for your presentation, Ned, and uh, and thanks to Pylon Tech for your support for this event.